Well, Oppenheimer has become quite the buzz, and as movie fanatics flock to movie theaters, some are making their way to San Antonio. That's because there are only two places in Texas where you can see the movie in 70 millimeter IMAX, and that includes the AMC River Center. But on Sunday, out of town viewers were sent home disappointed. This after showings were canceled. New tonight, Ken's Five's Andrew Moore tells us why one moviegoer says you should still try to see it. Yes, for some moviegoers, that 70 millimeter IMAX film was so important they traveled three hours or more to this theater right behind me. Here's how one moviegoer explains it. When you're watching this, there's no pixels. It's just crystal clear and it adds depth, it adds color. It allows him to make everything look bigger. The human eye doesn't see the world in pixels. And when you watch a film strip in IMAX, you aren't seeing them either. Just a picture in the way it was shot. But it requires a specialized projector, a massive amount of film. The film stock's 11 miles long and the damn thing weighs 600 pounds. And is only available a few places. Because there's only 19 theaters in the country that are running it. So when Nick Crookshank bought tickets two weeks ago, drove here from Austin early on Sunday, and found out his showing was canceled just three hours beforehand, he was upset. Immediately had to call my other three friends who were on their way down from Austin. And he wasn't alone either. There were plenty of moviegoers venting their frustration on Twitter that Sunday. Crookshank eventually spoke to the manager on the phone, and today, so did we. It turns out the theater only has one projector that can run IMAX 70mm, and there are only two people in the entire city that know how to use that projector. The manager also said a bulb burned out last weekend. Crookshank says the format has been used less since COVID, but it's just something that doesn't get used anymore. But he doesn't want it to die out. Now the movie theater has given him passes in compensation, and he's hoping that other moviegoers will also give it another shot. You have a literal chance to watch a literal piece of art. Andrew Moore, Gins 5.